went blind. When I went blind was what? Six years ago? Diabetic? What? Yeah. Say a diabetic. Okay. Yeah, but six years ago, diabetic complications. Alright man, so let's go to kick it out. Good no Brian, what we got going tonight? Man, um, mm. I call him Bus. People know him as Jeremy, but fam say he formerly known as all that, so we'll let him introduce himself. Yeah, everybody know me as Bus. Got me a new identity now. Who we fucking with? What's your new identity? Bang. Bang? What that How stand you spell for? That? B A I N Bang. Do that stand for something? What it stand for? Yeah. Blind and intriguingly nasty. That's for <laughs> grown folks. Yeah, yeah. How that come about? Mm. Right, eating that fruit cup like that. Man, <laughs> I was just in the face, nigga. Hold on. <laughs> This damn fruit cup banging right now. I feel like them kids. Man, I couldn't even talk right then in there, boy. Hey, you choked up. Boy, for real. But, yeah, that that came about. I've always been a, a wild nigga. Okay. But bang came about after uh, after I went blind. And then it just boosted and intensified all of that extra shit that you don't pay attention to. So, that's where the intriguingly part came from. <laughs> but, I always been a nasty nigga, so yeah. that ain't nothing new. <laughs> when'd, you, when'd you realize you was nasty? <laughs> <laughs> Boy, Oh, we. <laughs> Damn, fam, all them bluffs we smoked, man, know you were doing all this shit. <laughs> nah, it wasn't like that, nigga. It wasn't, it, it, it nigga, hold on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on. Hold on, motherfucker. Oh, man. Been a nasty nigga, but. Nah, I wasn't. I wasn't Kevin Gates and bitches. Now we gonna get that shit cleared up right now. Okay. Right now. God damn it. But shit. Let me see. With my baby mama. Shout out to Alex. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. She. She turned you up. Hell no, nah, I turned her out. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> it was more like teamwork, make the dream work. Yeah, 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 yeah. All yeah. right, but on, on a uh, more serious note, what was it like growing up in McKinney for you? Oh, shit, growing up in McKinney, man, shit. Hell, we ran the streets, shit, like little boys do. I don't know about what they do now. Say so these little niggas now, they, they way on a whole nother level than what we was. Shit. But shit, we grew up in McKinney, shit, running shit the east side, Sugar Hill, Mary, shit, Throckmorton, shit, all through this hood, shit. Everywhere. Goddamn like bandits, shit. Niggas know you wherever you at in the hood. Yeah, was you a bad kid? Nah. Were nah, you, I wasn't were you bad. A sneaky bad kid? <laughs> Nigga, we ain't nah. saying bad because you got caught. We talking about bad in the act, whether you got caught or not. Nah. Mm-hmm. Nah, not too much. Not too much. Nah. So you never played nigga knock, chunk rocks at cars or none of that? Nah, I wasn't chunking no rocks at no cars because I knew my. You wouldn't? Nah, I wasn't chunking no rocks at the was cars. You nigga. Them, was you dropping them out the bus while y'all was riding down the street? Hell nah, nigga just know mama and daddy gonna find out, nigga, your ass dropping rocks and throwing rocks at people. Call? <laughs> yeah, that's a good ass whooping for you right there, player. <laughs> yeah, we yeah. never got caught. 
<laughs> she, yeah, I just knew. She, nigga, nah, I'm gonna watch everybody do that one right there. <laughs> she, nah, mama done told a nigga about them cars, nigga. Yeah, you better not even be shit. Don't even fuck with that, uh, with that little emblem on the front of that bitch. Shit, be done got your damn fingers chopped off, man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so what was you into as a kid? Uh, up sports. I was about to say, I think all the young niggas that's my age, shit, we was all in the, more into sports. Shit, we were trying to be somebody, shit. Barry Sanders, Michael Jordan, some of that damn body. Shit. What position you play? Ooh, nigga. What you mean, position? Yeah, football. Well, you didn't even ask me what sport I played. Y'all haven't just tell somebody what I played. P- position. I your name, Buffs. Position. If anybody know everything. you, they already know what it was. <laughs> Every sport got positions. Yeah. Well, I could have been a forward. Yeah. <laughs> and football, nigga, what was your position? Ah, uh, shit, nigga, I was a shit. I played shit, DN, linebacker, fullback, running back. Shit. Yeah, that's it right there. Is that how you got the nickname Bus? Ah, uh, that name came from uh from running through niggas. Like uh, like that icon, Jerome Bettis. Yeah. yeah. Too big to handle. <laughs> you you looked up to him personally, or that's just somebody that they matched you with? Nah, that was somebody that I looked up to, watching football all the time. Big old greasy nigga. She <laughs> running through tackles. She <laughs> running through holes. Don't nobody want to tackle him. Yeah, yeah. Right. Bouncing off niggas, making niggas highlight reels. <laughs> All right. What about your brother? You know, he was that dude. Who, Ricky? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I get to him. Yeah, he had he had the shit. He had the shit. Hey, there you go. Hey, he yeah, had the yeah. shit. He had the shit. Hey, yo, younger you versus the younger him, would you run him over? Ah, oh, yeah. Shit, he was Nah, man. His bro couldn't handle me. Shit, he'd be hauling on, catching a ride, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Goddamn, shit. Uh, uh, uh. It'll look like D. Hen out there on some of them niggas. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Big Derrick Henry out there, shit. Minus all of that speed. <laughs> <laughs> he gonna catch me from the back. Yeah. But you anything else. Huh? You wasn't fast? Nah, I wasn't fast. If but I was, was fast, bro, in real life, <laughs> I just have to ask you that. If the school bus fast, do they got him in? Okay. Dude, we not finna do that. But I had enough. <laughs> I had enough wheels to compete with the niggas with wheels. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Say football speed and track speed are two different things. So you can be fast in the motherfucker, but when you put on the extra 25, 30 pounds or something, that speed deplete. Yeah, right. Hey, fam, in them party days of the ice bar, you know, uh, I keep telling them, dude, <laughs> how I was top five, how we used to go to them ice bars and, and showcase them skills. Top man. five, hey, top hey, five hey, what? Hey, but the funny thing is, this you ain't about fam. you. Yeah. You remember we was on the road touring? Yeah, thing, y'all niggas man. was over there in the D hitting them. Bus, bus driving, <laughs> we bring the honeys back, party until the next morning, till the sun come up. Till the sun Dallas come up. Tour. You know, once we brought them back, it was a tour. They was with us. Yeah. Yeah, you gotta understand that. <laughs> so, so, bang. In the first back cave. <laughs> <laughs> so, bang, you, was you supporting his rap, whatever you want to call it? Because he could rap, or because you were just his homeboy, and you know what I'm saying? He's my cousin, Mooney. Fam, it, all the same. Oh, okay. So, was he, was he just supporting that because blood, cause, or he could really rap to you? Mm. You always been a real nigga. Let's keep it that way. We gonna keep it that way. <laughs> we gonna keep it that way. I'm about to say shit. Now, keep it real, cuz they just, back then, I don't know about now, but I'm going to say back then, cuz just, he wasn't top notch, he was just starting, but I like some of the shit he was saying. Okay. 
I can respect that, yeah. Buzz. Yeah. I can respect that. But now, you know, I ain't... It's a different situation now. Yeah, because so it ain't no situation. He ain't, <laughs> he, ain't, he ain't drop shit. Yeah, ain't nothing else to speak on. Oh, he done retired. <laughs> he ain't start. He done retired already. <laughs> Damn, cuz. <'cause. laughs> How was it? Oh, um, what, what, what was the most epic night for you um, coming up in McKinney? You know, uh, what, what, what? What would be an epic night that you would always remember? As a youngster? Yeah. Mm. Sugar Hill. She, the shacks. That right there is, that's all I need to say, she. From my group, she, yeah, your late, group. Late nights. Man. Out in the breeze, man. Like, I was what's, just about what's going to, on at Sugar Hill? I was about to say, <laughs> man, she. From around here, she. I'm gonna say she, the '90s through the, let me see. I'm gonna say probably till about oh seven. Yeah. Sugar Hill was was live live. We were still holding, trying to hold it together at them last years. <laughs> we didn't say what was out there. Oh, uh, what was out there? Yeah. Shit, nigga, the hood. Hell, everybody, <laughs> shit. It didn't matter, shit. Man, it, shit, you liable to run into your mama or daddy out there, shit. Talking about mama, what you doing out here, shit. They yeah. looking at you, wondering the same shit. What you doing out here, yeah, shit. Everybody kicking it. Hell yeah, shit. It was like, shit, a big party, shit, from the front to the back of the apartment, shit. Every weekend. Man, there was somebody out everywhere. Shit, either in the breezeway, sitting on the patio. Shit, nigga just stop and chop it up anywhere. And shit, if the law fuck with you, shit, nigga gonna jump on the goddamn patio. Nigga, I'm right here, nigga. Shit, leave me alone. <laughs> <laughs> shit. Goddamn shit, fuck around and knock on your patio. Do, 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 like you there. Hell, no damn well you ain't at home. Yeah. <laughs> What you miss most about those times? Shit. It wasn't... It wasn't so harassive. The the laws wasn't so harassive back then. They were harassing, but they on some whole... Man, nigga can't even barely can walk down the street, shit. Yeah. Without them hoes being harassing. Shit. That's it, man. Shit, if the police wasn't, didn't make it seem like we just over here just doing the most, then I feel like it'll be better. Yeah. But they over here, like, on every corner, like, shit, like it's somebody doing something, shit, and it don't even be nobody out, shit. I be walking the Walk in the hood now and be like, man, is it anybody? Is this bitch alive? <laughs> she is quiet. Man, quiet to the motherfucker everywhere. You don't even hear nobody riding down, riding down the street banging no more. Shit, you might hear maybe one or two calls. Shit, maybe. Shit, and they just doing a, a ride through. <laughs> in and out. <laughs> yeah. In and out real quick. <laughs> they on their way out. That part right there. On their way up out this bitch. Let me fly through here and see if yeah. anybody out I know. <laughs> nope, ain't nobody over here you know no more. <laughs> everybody done moved out the hood down there. Jeez. How, how did life uh, feel after after you lose lost your vision? Um, when, when did it, you lose your vision? What, and and when, when did you lose it? And did it send you into a depression or, you know, you know, just let us know how life changed for you and how you had to adapt. Mm. Going blind. When I went blind was what? Six years ago? Diabetic? What? Yeah. Say a diabetic. Yeah, but six years ago, diabetic complications. See, say, but uh, yeah, in the beginning it was a. Uh, 
it was more of me not in the beginning it was more of me not wanting I guess shit at a point like once it happened I was at like fuck. But I think it was more of the support system.